Hey everybody, welcome back to Recordology. Today, we're taking a look at a CD player, and I've said this so many times on this channel, like, this is the CD player of all CD players, because they come out with these features, and I'm like, I didn't know this was even a thought process. And then you're like, well, it can't get any better than this, it can't get any different, what else can you do with the CD player? Then I saw this, and I'm like, this may actually take it to the next level. This says that it has hi-fi speakers, RGB lights, so that's interesting, the Type-C charging, built-in lithium-ion battery, TF card playback, but what's really interesting is it's got TF card recording. You can record from your CDs onto a TF or SD card, and it's got Bluetooth in and out. So let's go ahead and open it up. Very curious to how they pull this off. And if the speakers are listenable, because you know, sometimes I've seen CD players like portable or personal CD players that have like a built-in speaker system and it's just adequate, you know? So if they actually made it like truly good, that would be, that would be impressive. So looks like we've got an 18 month warranty. This is the USB-C, love USB-C. An eighth inch audio connection or jack i should say and then oh this is very weird okay that's really interesting wow okay so it's like a little set top thing now i was expecting like a little you know discman type of thing but this is clearly not that which is good i mean let's let's make it interesting right all right wow look at this thing that's wild it looks like an award. That is so unique. Okay, I dig the unique factor right off the bat. So it is plastic construction. Look at the back of this thing. Look at that. It looks very Star Wars-y. Isn't that interesting? And then down here we've got an optical input or output. Optical output, that's amazing on a little portable thing like this. Type-C USB, there's a little light for the battery, headphone jack, TF card slot, and then this interesting back panel. And then the speaker. So is that the hi-fi speaker? So it's obviously mono. And then it uh, looks like we've got some buttons down here. Let's take a closer look down there. Okay, so we've got some buttons over here. This says it's a lighting control, followed by a loop mode and recording button a previous shutdown timer. Up here we've got a um, mode switch, I believe, a play, pause, stop, a forward skip, and I think that's it. This is on, off, and volume. And as it says down here in the corner, hot technology brings wonderful life. And again up here, hot technology brings wonderful life. This is, how do you open it? Okay, the door opens up. So weird. There's a card stock thing protecting the transport. And then a look closer here. Kind of a frosted plastic. You can see the CD transport in there. Awesome. I guess we need to get a CD. For our music today, I thought we would listen to the sound of Austria. A treasury of Alpine folk music. I love this music. This was given to me by a friend in the UK. And it's excellent music to work by. And it ought to prove to be fairly copyright friendly, I hope. So we're going to go ahead and put the CD on the spindle. Like that. Close the door. Oh, it's a magnetic closure on the door, so that's nice. Okay, I had to I had to recalibrate things. I just got too excited because this needs to be done in a very certain way. With the lights down, the blinds closed. Check this out. Tell me this isn't the coolest thing you've ever seen. Got the RGB light ring all the way around. And then the disc spins up. That is incredible, you guys. Look at that thing. And I'll, I'll show you the uh, speaker, the audio quality here in a minute, but just from a visual standpoint, look at this thing. Let's spin it around back, see what it looks like. Wow. That is so cool. This is like much more than I expected. Wow. Okay, this CD player really does take the cake. It's not a 
Discman, it's not like something you're gonna put in your pocket and but by the nightstand, like on the bedside, this would be perfect. That is so cool. All right, let's listen to the sound quality with the microphone pointing right at it. Okay, now that we've geeked out over the lights, um, I want to focus on the sound quality. So I've got the mic facing towards the product. All we have for speakers is little speaker right down here. But I'm starting to think this is like, just to have playing by the bedside, you know what I mean? Like, it's like your alarm clock audio kind of a thing. I'm not, my expectations are not lessened, they're just changed for a different use case. So let's go ahead and fire this beauty up. Man, that looks good. Down here you can see this, um, I don't know if you call it a display, I guess it's a display. So it's showing, showing the loading capability there. Interesting, they didn't try putting an FM scan radio in this. But let's listen to the audio quality. couple tracks. You know, for what it is, it sounds fine. I don't think that it sounds tinny or small. It's not gonna be like some super boomy audio, but for what it is, it's, it's awesome. I think this is incredible. I wonder if it can... Yeah, it seems to play at different angles. Not that you would need to do that, because it's not really... Like, you're not gonna carry this on a hike or something. Doesn't that look like so cool? Okay, let's go ahead and test out a couple of things here. Let's go over to Bluetooth and I'm going to connect my phone to this. So let's see here. Okay, I got a little chime when the camera wasn't playing, uh, when the camera wasn't rolling, my apologies there. But let's go ahead and uh, see if we can play our music on this speaker. Seems to work good. We still got the lights and everything. Yeah, so another Bluetooth speaker in our life. <laughs> Probably not the most exciting feature for me. Um, let's go ahead and try out the Bluetooth transmission feature. Okay, in order to transmit Bluetooth, we're gonna need to put this over into CD mode. And then we're gonna long press the M button, which will put it into pairing mode. And then the little pairing light under the A on load there is flashing. Put my Bluetooth speaker on. So it can take 20 to 60 seconds. So let's sit there and wait until it connects. There you go. That didn't take long at all. Okay, now we're going to do some stuff with the TF card. We're going to play back audio from a TF card and then we are going to record audio to the TF card. So I'm going back here, inserting my TF card in this slot. Always do it the wrong way. Apparently upside down is the way. And the little fingernail is not a bad thing because you have to kind of stick it in there and then it catches. Okay, and turn it on and we switch modes and I'm at TF. So TF doesn't come up unless there is an actual card in there. So we've got our uh, music playing there off the TF card. And now what I wanna do is make a recording. Now from the manual, it looks like there's some, um, you can create recording loops and you can do a little bit fancier stuff when it comes to recording. But I just wanna make a simple, dumb recording. I wanna hit record, hit stop, and then listen to that recording. So we're gonna go back over to CD player. And let's skip forward a few tracks so we have something a little bit new to listen to. And again, I'm using the vocal mic now, so the audio won't be as you know pristine as when we were listening earlier in terms of the music. Um, but you can kind of get an idea when it's present and not. Okay, so we have music playing, and what we want to do is press and hold this button. And then they call this the CD burn light, although it's not burning a CD, because it's not recording to CD. It's recording off of the CD 
onto the TF card. And as we make this recording, my first thought is what resolution is this recording, right? So I'm going to, as soon as we're done filming this clip, I'm gonna go take this SD card over to my computer, plug it in and see exactly what the sound quality is, or at least the resolution of the recording is. Okay, so I was surprised. The recorded quality is much better than I thought. Usually devices that record to SD card are limited to 128K MP3 files. This was 320K MP3, so substantially higher quality, which is fantastic. Man, this thing's a beauty. I just think it looks so cool. This is very R2-D2-ish, isn't it? I mean, this looks so cool. Um, so yeah, that's really good. And I want you guys to listen to that audio directly. So here is a direct feed of that recorded file. changes it makes oh cool you can go solid colors like oh that is so cool you can pick different colors so there's like different modes that is so cool man that's awesome i like the rainbow color but that is really really cool man that's awesome so yeah that's a very unique little device. Uh, I had a lot of fun with this, as you can tell. So if you are interested, I see no problem with it. It's a great little thing. Um, use cases, again, nightstand. Uh, time will tell whether or not it's too bright for the nightstand at night, you know, if, you, if this is just too much flashing and bright light, or possibly in the kitchen, or, you know, do you, I don't know if you guys like to have like a, a little radio or something in your bathroom by the sink. Like when you're brushing your teeth, have a little music, something like that. Or desktop, perfect for the desk. Doesn't take up much space at all, considering it's a vertical CD player. And, um, you know, we didn't even touch on, on the back here, you've got this optical output, so you could connect it to your, uh, you know, sounds. It's an interesting feature they would put on that. Um, and then the analog out for the headphone jack as well, so you can listen to uh, privately on your headphones if you didn't want to use a little built-in speaker get that full stereo effect. But yeah, that's gonna do it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this look at this cool, hot CD player. And uh, again, link down below. Thank you guys for all the support. And we've got so much coming your way. I can't wait to share it with you. Lots of cool products, lots of cool events, and just a lot of fun coming your way on Recordology. That's gonna do it for today. So happy record hunting, and we'll see you next time.